Wrong button. <laughs> hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to uh, Lost Islands. I'm Flinger Foo, and uh, well, today I'm actually kind of uh, setting things up so where I can start. I, I want to go over and take a look at one of the caves, which means that I need to clear out some of my inventory because there's some of the stuff you just don't need while you're in the caves. Um, I, I think I'm gonna leave the. Oh, uh, let's see. I think I'm gonna leave the crossbow here. A few other things. Um, I don't think I honestly think I need the crossbow. I probably don't need the long neck either. Um, yeah, we should be good with that, I think. Uh, we don't need trinks. Um, although we do need arrows. Why did I? Oh. Oh, I've got two stacks. Of... Ah, that's why. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, I was trying to figure out why I. Uh, well, I was leaving arrows unexpectedly. All right, so let's pick you up. You've got plenty of chitin on you. Uh, let's see. Um, oh, we need to dump this stuff off inside of a storage box. But yeah, I want to go take a look over the desert cave. I want to get over there, knock that sucker out, or at least uh, die trying. Um, but yeah, it should be uh, kind of fun. I've been looking forward to this cave for a while. And also, there's plenty of stuff to do. Uh, let's see. I'm going to need torches. Um, I may gamma it a little bit because this cave is dark. Um, I don't like normally gammaing, uh, because, frankly, I think it kind of kills the immersion a little bit, and then also, uh, the less you have to open up the cheat console, the better. Alright, so, uh, let's see. Um, so there's Sea Pickle, there's a Parasaur going across our lagoon. Alright, I think we can just fly over there. I mean, we've got green in our pocket. Uh, I, I don't need all these cryopods. I don't want to lose all these. The, and apparently I'm dehydrated as well. There we go. Alright, uh, let's see. Cryopods. Here we go. And also, since it's part of taming and I don't want to lose it, that can go in there. You know what? Actually, you never know when that thing's going to come in handy. You never do. All right, so I'm going to keep it. I do need to start working on a little bit more shotgun shells, though. All right, so let's get our butt headed over. So I believe it's over this way. There's a little river. You take the river, and then you follow the river, and then you go in, up the river, and then it eventually inserts you into... Oh, that is not an, another alpha megalodon down there, is it? No, it's just a regular Megalodon. Lots of steely birds over here. Oh, man. I have noticed this map seems to have a large amount of Megalodons. Or Alpha Megalodons. I mean, a very large amount. Which actually would be pretty good once we're ready to start going into the water. I just need uh, scuba stuff. Yeah, I mean, lots of scuba stuff would be really, really good. Yeah. All right, so hey, I'm going to be doing this, and I will see you guys in just a bit. All right, so we come over this way, and I believe it's up this little riverbed right here. All right, you see that scorched earth? I'm going up your riverbed. This is wicked pretty, though. Then again, I'm just blown away by uh, how good this map looks. Constantly blown away. And I need to get down a little bit early. So once I find the cave, I think I'm going to pop down and then make a bed. Just in case. Now this isn't. Up. This is one the canyon. <laughs> yeah. Canyons are great for Sonoma crops as well. That's it. All right, let's go take a look over here. All right, here we go. It's this one. Right up through here. Right, there is the cave, right up there, which means that we need to get... 
some hide for a bed and also craft a foundation and stuff. We can do that right up here. No, I'm just going to take that and put that down here because I have a feeling I'm going to need it. I have an empty slot on my bar, so... Oh, sorry, uh... Your boys. Come here. There we go. All right, um, let's see. No dire wolves or anything? All right. This. Then fiber and hide. Fiber. Here. Hey, nailed it. Oh, I mean hide. Come here, dude. Thank you. Wrong button. You know what? If I can make two, I might as well make two. Uh, also, we're going to need a foundation. Oh, we need more wood. Where did that tree go? Sorry. Sorry. And we don't need that stuff, that stuff, that stuff, that stuff. And I probably should have brought something other than desert cloth armor. This stuff's probably going to get destroyed. Oh, one thing I did need. I did need a... Uh... Healing brews. I may have to head back to base. Yes, sorry, sorry Jerboas. You're just kind of hanging out there. I'm sorry. Yeah, I may have to head back to base to get some healing brews really quick. Because rabies is a thing. Also, I don't want desert cloth armor. Alright, so hey, I will see you guys in just a minute. I got to rectify this. Alright, while I'm here, I may as well grab some, uh... More narcotics. I mean, right? Take all the Tinto berries. You know, I don't want to make a super ton amount of these, but you know what? We we need enough. I'm thinking maybe 20, 25 should be good. All right, let's see. Uh, narcotics. Go. Sure, that'll work. All right. Oh, I need to fill those. Give me those back. You can't have those yet. Gosh. All right. All right you guys need to get out of the way. Later, Dung Beetles. All right. I'm going to get this stuff I'm burning. I will see you guys in just a bit. All right, so I figured since I'm here, I may as well uh, just cook off all the rest of these berries. I mean, might as well. It's only like 10, 15 more. I mean, maybe 20 more than I had originally intended. But you know what? They'll come in, they'll come in handy, and some are going to spoil in my inventory anyway. So, all right. All right, that should do it. All right, let's get our butt back over. Okay. And it's this way. All right, let's get down here. Yeah, I'm gonna also leave blue out here, outside of a cryopod. That way there, in case if I have a uh, mishap, then I can run back in right away and get my stuff back. Alright, good job, blue! 
All right, keep it up. Uh, let's see. I think go. We'll, yeah, there we go. All right, now let's grab an eight. And I'm very curious uh, to see just how well a Thyla does inside of this game. It's gonna get dark here wicked fast. Where's my torch? Go. Here we go. All right, let's see. Okay. Oh, there's some um, Onik up ahead. Oh no, and Arthaplura. Lots of Arthaplura. Right, let's see. That's a lot of Arthaplura. Yeah, I saw that. Holy, wow, that's a lot of Arthur Fleur. Come on. Come on, dude. Dude, all your rest of your buddies died. There you go. Thank you. I appreciate the cooper. Wow, that is a lot already. I appreciate the cooperation. Want to come play? Okay. Oh, that was 140 on. Oh. Okay. Whew. And we're already force feeding just a little bit. Wow. Okay. So the entrance to the cave, breaking into the cave, is a little bit tricky. Not bad. But hey, I got some whips out of the deal. That's a good thing. Nice. All right, so we've got a uh, junction. Left or right? Let's go right. Whoa, hello. I didn't even see you guys. That happened. Sorry, snail. Sorry. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay. left. A bunch of stuff down there. Sorry. Is this the one that just curves around? Alright, let's see. And that goes way up there. Oh, hey, that's pretty cool. Alright, what does this one back here do? Just go back the exact same? Oh. Okay. So this is the way I went. All right, all right. Okay, I'm picking up what they're putting down. Right. Did I left fit through here? I smacked that rock, maybe? The less I have to cryo green, the better, I think. Broken. Oh no, it just ain't gonna fit. All right. All right. Let's see what else is over this way first, and then we'll mark this one as come back to here in a sec. Go. 
this way. Hello. Sorry, guys. Sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Go, just go back to your shell for now. Thank you. Ooh, wow. This is the other... Oh, this is the block. Oh, okay, so that just went around that way. Okay, so you can just go left and then circumvent that entire small thing. why I brought the bow. Thank you. Green's really getting a lot of XP in here. This is pretty, though. Oh, you're encumbered. Drop that for now. Thank you. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Coming through. That's just crystal. That just curves around that way. Okay. I'm seeing what they're doing here. It's kind of running parallel, but it's interweaving as it's going, which is kind of cool. That's cool. All right. Here, and then it should meet up. Yeah, back over here. Come on, snake. the snake right there. We'll grab that dude. Come here, man. I already took out your buddy, dude. You're good. Thank you. All this stuff repaired. Alright, let's try this guy. Oh. And there's 
You can swim through that, right? Not sure if there is anything over there, but Let's go over this way. Hi guys! I think this is the way it goes. Oh, I'm getting encumbered. Um. All right, guess it's force feeding time. All right, what is that though? Is that a bone? That's oh, weird. All right, let's pop through here. More Arthoplura. Oh, where's your buddy? More buddies to the right. I don't know where the guy to the left went. So much XP in caves. Right first. Oh, this is that one that goes up, huh? Go up this wall. There we go. Look at this! Yeah, loot! Am I high enough level? Yes! Oh, okay, so not nearly as good as I was hoping. But hey, alright, you know what? Loot is loot. things in this game. You know, you would think that that these guys would have, like, some sort of ecosystem that actually cleared out some of them. So, you know what, Mr. Snake? Do me a big favor by actually eating an Onik or two. That would really help out. This is that water pit, right? Swim through. Yeah. Way down there. I think so. This is the exit. Where does this exit? You can come up this way and get the backside. Okay. All right. That's pretty cool. 
Right, let's get back over this way and let's go see if we can find anything else. But this, I'm digging this cave. This cave is really neat. Oh my god, there's a lot of bad stuff right here. There that goes. That's why I didn't want to bring the desert. Okay. Almost a 10,000 hit point. Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, look at this. This is very reminiscent of Scorched Earth. I mean, granted, we are in the Scorched Earth area, but... Wait, have I already been here? Maybe? Things already respawned. Oh yeah, because that's that spawn. Okay. Huh. Yeah, this place respawns pretty fast. That's kind of cool. Alright, so I went back around. Here, hold on. Let me show you which way I went. Back around to this spot. And there's like this big, huge sun uh, bit that's coming through. Kind of marking. Apparently we can't get through there. Oh, I can hear an artifact. Yep, there's the artifact. All right, let's see. Fly up this way. All right, artifact of the brute. Nice. That looks wicked cool. I like how the artifact is actually kind of hidden and you have to get in there on foot. Makes you hop off your dino. Hey, Green. Doing great. I'm kind of looking around, seeing if I can find some more loot, but I'm not seeing any. Let me go swim down through that one area. I have to figure out where it's at now. It's been a minute since I was there. Yeah, this thing will take you on all sorts of twists and turns, and before you know it, you'll be lost. All right. Hey, sorry, Actina. I, I keep telling them that every time they come by. I just get underneath it. Go see if there's anything back here. I'm not sure if there is. Although I'm telling you, it would be wicked... Uh cool to have like a two so down here. <laughs> well, it'd be evil, but yeah. Be like the cracking in the hole. Alright, but I think that's probably it. One loot, though, I'm a bit... I was expecting a bit more. Probably one that I'm just not seeing. Either that or there was only one uh, spawning at this moment. Who knows? And way back should be this way. Nope. I'm oh, sorry, Actina. Yeah, here we are. Here's the entrance. It just goes right down this way. That was fun! I love doing little caving adventures. That was a blast! I didn't even need blue. And there's blue! Alright. Alright, let's take uh, you, pop you back inside. Actually, this. Eh, actually, I don't think it matters. Pop you inside of here. There are some raptors down there that we're messing with earlier before I even went in the cave. Do you have anything on you? Other than a ton of chitin? And that is a lot of chitin. Alright, so yeah, if you guys need a bunch of chitin, come to this cave. 
<laughs> I mean, there's a lot of it. I think I've probably thrown out many, many thousands of chitin. Right, are these still the raptors who were messing with me when I came in? I would imagine they are. All right, well, hey, I'm going to head back to base, and uh, yeah. All right, so uh, Cave of the Brute. Pretty dang fun. I'm digging it. That was awesome. All right, let's get back in here to base. Let's see if I actually have enough uh, obsidian to craft a base for this. And it, oh my, this fog. It was hard to actually spot the island from the air on the way back. In the island from the air. That was insane. All right. Uh, let's see. Artifact. Pedestal. 10. 80 obsidian. I don't know if I have enough of that. Oh, I do. Hey, look at that. Uh, let's see. Is it, uh, there we go. Nailed it, and that's all my obsidian. Bam. All right, uh, where do we want to put this sucker? You know what? Let's put it over here. Let's get a nice, oh, you guys were awaiting my return, huh? All right, fine. All right, I'm going to put this over here. Green gets. That's set up. All right, and there we go. All right, sweet. Okay, so uh, hey, I think that's probably um, going to do it for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I had a ton of fun. Yeah, if you haven't already, make sure you click that like button. I really appreciate it. If you're new around here, subscribe. Until next time, this is Fligger Foo, and take it easy, everybody.